Now, we want you to find out about more about our progress as we continue our fight against childhood obesity. The message is clear, and sometimes it's best told by a classmate. Hey, Howard. And I'm Carolyn Murray of WCBD-TV News 2. We are in the fight against childhood obesity, and we have a few reminders for you. Remember, limit your screen time to two hours or less. And when you have a food choice, make sure that you choose fresh fruit and vegetables. And remember, exercise daily. <laughs> no, <laughs> Brendan Clark is feeling a little uneasy. No, that's not a little Brendan. That's rising fifth grader old Chase Howard. He's a student at Charleston Collegiate School on Johns Island, and he visited our Channel 2 studios recently after noticing our reports on childhood obesity. Well, around the same time, Chase and his classmates had the task of using $1 million toward developing a nonprofit organization. Chase came up with a great idea of Healthy Kids for Life. It's a group that would lease a building West Ashley install a swimming pool, buy fitness equipment, and even get kids a weekly share of fresh fruits and vegetables from Ambrose Farms, a local farm. Congratulations, Chase, on scoring a perfect 100 on your project and also sharing what you've learned about childhood obesity. Brendan, back to you.